What is up, my friends? Let's talk about who the fuck did kill Bryce Walker in 13 Reasons Why. Now, we'll be making another video where I talk about the ending to 13 Reasons Why and everything else I think that is going to come to light in the next uh, season. But for now, I just want to make a video talking about the big question on everybody's mind for this season. Who killed Bryce Walker? So, I mean, the whole season for the, the longest was taking you all over the place, you know. We're getting bits and pieces of what happened um, that night that Bryce Walker died. Uh, people were getting uh, exonerated because they saw how Bryce died. It was because of blunt trauma. And then we were wondering, then who the hell did kill Bryce Walker? Well, in the end, we finally got our answer. And we have two killers, one made up and one the real killer. The made up killer is Monty. Monty, as we know, went to prison and got killed because of what happened to uh, Tyler. And now Monty is the one who killed Bryce Walker, apparently. At least that's what everybody wants you to think because as the last episode's called, I believe, Let the Dead Bury the Dead, we see that Annie helps make up the story of what actually happened that night. And that story pretty much says that Monty killed Bryce. Well, the true story is Zach and Bryce got into a fight at the pier. Bryce, of course, was really, really severely beaten. I mean, he couldn't even stand up or walk. And then Alex and Jessica show up, and he's like, Jessica, Bryce, of course, I need to give you something. It's a tape where he pretty much confesses to everything he did to Jessica and Hannah and apologizes for it. He wants Hannah's mom to uh, listen to it. And then Jessica is pretty much like leaving. And then Alex is like, we have to help him because it's freezing cold out here. He can't walk. He's going to freeze to death. And she's like, if we leave him and he freezes to death, then Zach goes to jail. But if we help him, Zach goes to jail. So they're in a little conflict, you know. And then Alex tries to help him. Jessica's walking away. Bryce gets pissed off screaming at Jessica saying that she set him up. And Alex just loses it. He says, you've hurt everyone I've ever loved. And he starts pushing Bryce. They start struggling. They're on the edge of the dock. And then Bryce just rolls down into the water. He can't move, of course, as I said. He can't do anything. And he just pretty much dies. And that's how it is. That's what happened. Um, so they put this whole plan together, uh, Annie, in order to help Clay, who is pretty much now... Uh, suspect number one in the police's eyes and she pretty much says that Monty is the one that had uh, Bryce killed and they lay out this whole um, elaborate plan that pretty much can't go unraveled because how could it because Monty is dead he cannot defend himself deputy knows that Alex did it but of course he wants to protect his son so he's gonna go along with the cover-up and they burn the clothes that Alex was wearing that night and that's pretty much it Bryce's murder case is closed and that's until season four my friends because we're gonna get a lot of shit and I'm gonna talk about that in my ending explained how this whole story is gonna unravel and I will just wonder what the consequences will be so I'm gonna talk about that in my upcoming video for 13 reasons why season three any explained make sure you tune in that's coming today today so if you're watching this video and you want to know more about uh, what's gonna happen my thoughts make sure you subscribe we still got to talk about that fisherman and everything else that season four is gonna like er, like i think season four is gonna be the most explosive so make sure you subscribe to my channel make sure you like make sure you comment turn on the bell notifications if you haven't already because my friends we are talking so much now about 13 reasons why and what's coming next but anyways as always if you haven't already subscribed Hit that subscribe button, like, comment, share. Let me know in the comments below who you thought was going to be Bryce's killer and why. And what do you think is going to happen next season? I'd like to know. But anyways, 13 Reasons Why, Season 3, Any Explained, later today. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you comment. Make sure you share. I'll see you all next time. Stay positive.